Great to see Peter wandering around that beautiful home in Prospect. Gee, we've got some lovely homes. What about Steph in that Unley Park property? Doesn't get much better than that, does it? That is just an awesome, awesome home. And I hope you enjoy watching these segments because I sure do, and I'm in the business. Now, um, just a couple of other things with regard to Adrian Hondras, who is the number one guy for the private bank, Commonwealth Bank. For those of you uh, that are in the investment area and have a few properties, it may well be possible for you to get into the private bank because they have got special deals for their clients and it's something that would be well worth looking at. So give me a call direct if you want to have a chat about it. So if you've got four or five rental properties, you're an investor, um, by all means, give me a call and I'll introduce you to the private bank and have a chat with them. Uh, and the full episode, the fireside chat, which will be uncut, is on Friday at midday, and then after that we'll be in our library. So the first viewing uh, of that, uh, which is a really good uh, interview with Adrian, will be aired at 12 o'clock on Friday at www. .toop.tv. Now in the studio here today we have, as you know, Mr Roger Smith, he's uh, a bit of a guru down at the, down at the Flurio. <laughs> Roger, um, at this time we normally go through some questions that people have, have um, emailed us over the week or over the fortnight, yep. um, but I really want to drill down a little bit deeper into the Flurio with this um, Invest Flurio promotion that's starting really this week today. Yep. Um, if, if you had people that you knew, would you recommend them to buy at the moment in the Fleurio or are you just flogging property? Oh no, I think the, the market's at a point where um, I think now is the ideal time for, for people to come in. I mean, if mum and dad said to me that they wanted to do something right now, it would be right, well come down and I'll find you a property down here. Because the returns are becoming so much better from a rental point of view, both holiday and permanent, as well as obviously the capital growth um, on the coast has always been great. Um, but with the market shifting the way it has, we're probably now getting to the bottom and I reckon we're now pretty well at the point where everyone's got to come in. Well, my family go back to 1950, where my grandfather, Lou Toop, opened the first Toop Motors garage, which is Holden Garage in Victor. Now, even in those days as a child, that was, by the way, before I was born, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but even as a child, I remember Victor as being a holiday blue chip destination Surely, with the mining boom, with the, um, the, the fact the city's spreading basically down towards Victor, with the better access, with the cheap prices at the moment, the absolutely incredibly good buying, add all that together, I would have thought best buying in five years. Is that something you could confidently believe in? Oh, definitely. H hand on the heart stuff that it's uh, now's the time to do that. As you said, it's just that infrastructure sort of spreading out now. Um, and the fact that we genuinely are an hour away from Adelaide um, from a commuting point of view. Mining families looking at a lifestyle change, they want the kids to grow up in a semi-country environment um, but have easy access back to the city for, for them obviously doing their fly-in, fly-out process. So. Now Roger, is it still time for anyone to jump onto the uh, Easter auction? Yeah, it's getting tight, isn't it? Yeah, it is. If, uh, if anyone's got a home that they think would be ideal for us to put on the market for this campaign, then, then give me a call at any time and uh, we'll come and talk to you straight away. But yeah, time's getting a bit, bit thin. And buyers who have maybe kind of made, get organised, go and see the bank? Yeah, definitely go and see the bank. Get yourself pre-approved. Um, come and see us. Um, we'll obviously look at all of the properties. We'll look at offers prior as well. And uh, all of the vendors are keen, as I said, to move the properties prior as well as on the day. So. And can you help people if they're not sure how to go about it? Yep, yeah, definitely. We'll we've got that process in place and we've got a team down there to support uh, every question that comes up. Roger Smith, great to have you on the show. Thanks Anthony. Now let's go to Hot Property.
that's all we have time for on today's show. Hope you enjoyed the program and make sure you get to Victor Harbour in the next couple of weeks to check out some of the great properties we have down there. Also, make sure you tune in next week as we'll be going to North Adelaide to have a look at one of SA's finest properties. That'll be next Wednesday at one o'clock. But for now, here's some more hot properties.